No more talking about it When we ignite We are stars In a darkened sky When you Hi Libra, welcome to my channel. We're doing your reading for Besides Love. It's called Besides Love. How about that? Career, finances, and love. So all those, family life, married, divorce, separation, you want two, three, four, I don't know, whatever you want. But what I want you to get is the, um, yes, we just dropped that, the abundance box. Okay, so check it out. I told you every week is new. This channel never seems to stop producing whatever we want to send you guys out into your mailbox. So this one though is very special because it comes with a Jupiter um, webinar that I had previously. So it's available together with it and also an app for the, tri the trial app, trial seven day trial for the app that I use for astrology. I mean, if that is not bombing, then that prosperity Maldivite, that agate, I got all these things here, the necklace, the sweet grass, oh, I, all those. And, and then, I mean, it just keeps giving. It's an abundance box. Also follow me on Instagram because I was there live. I always give the first release on Instagram and I teach there. I go to IGTV and I teach a bunch of stuff with regards to what you are manifesting okay so let's see what's going on for my libra okay is your career finances okay. here we go let's see i always like to start with you guys especially if it's a new release okay and let's see here we go wow Pay my bills, you pay my telephone bills, eight of pentacles. <laughs> so I'll tell me how to pay the bills. Well, one, never be late. Saturn, disapprove of late, okay? Um, it looks like um, what's on top of your head is the bills, how to get across. You're not paycheck to paycheck, but this is more of being practical with your spending. This is what we call tightening the belt. Ooh, Libra does not like that. A Taurus or a Virgo would, <laughs> but not a Libra. <laughs> You're looking at this. This is what we call, you know, this is, you know, something that we do not mention. Budgeting. <gasps> budgeting. That's what it's here. You're thinking of different side hustle. You're thinking how to make more um, money and stuff like that. Abundance. You're, you're probably thinking of a passive income. Mm -hmm. I'm going to teach that in my business and success webinar. Okay, so that's coming this July. So if you want to get out of that debt, if you want to get out of that, um, you know, like month, you know, paycheck to paycheck, well, I will share you the secrets. Yes, uh, I was once paycheck to paycheck. I was making $7.50 an hour in a basement. Okay, well, no, 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 no. <laughs> it doesn't sound good. I was in a basement because I was a pastry chef. The fridge was there. <laughs> Stop it. All right, <laughs> in a basement. <laughs> It sounds like I was in a different trade. Okay. Eight of Pentacles. Okay. So you've been thinking about, okay, what are the different ways to make money? There's so many ways, guys. It's the 2020. Like, you can open TikTok and you're already making bank. You know, third house is not how it was before, meaning our third house, Libra. Third house used to be just education. Ninth house is higher education. Now, third house is social media. Imagine that, right? So, um, you know, it depends on your chart, of course, Libra Ascendant and Libra Moon. You're thinking of other ways. When I say social media, it's because Libra Scorpio Sag is your third house. Jupiter, Libra Scorpio Sag, yeah. Jupiter right now is retrograding your third house, which is um, social media. So you're probably thinking of a YouTube channel, am I right? 
Online business, yes. Mm-hmm. That's that one. Uh, um, third house. Third house is ruled by Mercury. Merchandise. And you're thinking, you have a nine to five. You have a nine to five. You're thinking of other ways, other sources of income. I like that. You're thinking like an entrepreneur, okay? Remember, third house is the birth of the idea of what we desire. Six house, these are called Dustana houses. Oh, yeah, Upachaya or Dustana? Dustana. Um, Pasaya, Upachaya is eight, uh, six, eight, twelve. Uh, Dustana. Birth of dream, third house. Execution of the dream, sixth house. How strong your dream, outcome, tenth and eleven. Okay? So, I mean, like, if you are familiar with astrology, but that's why I'm going to teach, okay? Because when you know to work those houses, then your dreams and goals, it's easy to work with, okay? Doesn't mean that you're going to be a rock star, but you might be sleeping with one. I'm kidding. That's different. Okay. Eight of Pentacles. Keep thinking. I like that. Mm -hmm. Now let's see what's in your family. Your family. Okay, you got a Queen of Wands. Um, see, here's the problem with your savings, Libra. Okay. Is that you have a tendency to save, and then you have the tendency to spend more with what you save. We've all been there. We've all been there. Because... This is a specific spread that I use for career finances, okay? So I won't be able to explain it to you, but this is your savings right now. The way that I see your saving is like you always have this weakness. Sal, I just need a perm. Girl, who gets a perm? It's already the extension days, okay? So, <laughs> um, you know, it's like, Sal, I just need a mani-pedi. I mean, like count that mani-pedi for like a whole year. Plus, of course, right now we're not allowed to get out anyway. Like these are little things, okay? These little things adds up. So I just need my organic kale. I mean, come on. A kale is a kale, okay? That's just branding right there. Mm hmm Because there are certain luxuries that you, okay, that you purchase, that, and this is your weakness, okay? So make sure you identify, cut back on that. I see here that you, there are times that you just want to change your clothes. Like, well, there was a sale sale. What do you expect me to do? I just want to change the furniture sale. What do you want me to do? I want you to burn that credit card. The first um, remedy that you will do when you're trying to get out of the debt, burn the credit card. Yes, the best remedy. Cut it, snip it, I don't care, shred it. Yes, okay? Best remedy. Oh, my remedies are very practical and at the same time metaphysical when I teach. Okay. Death card. Okay. Now, you have a lot of things that you have been trying to, um, let's just say, you're thinking of a, a business. You're constantly changing this idea. Okay. It's a birth. You're giving this. You, you have this. You've done the research. Now you're trying to understand, hmm, maybe I should change this. Maybe I should change that. That's good. So there is going to be growth. Uh, there's a potential growth for that. Now, there are some also for you who might, who might get an inheritance. I'm seeing here their inheritance. Um, there are, there's a friend also who likes you, I'm seeing here. So they're trying to cross the part of like, hmm, you know, they're trying to see if they have a chance with you. Okay. Now, the death card here um, shows that um, there will be big changes with regards to, um, how to say this, uh, a relationship with a past can be. If you are in your second marriage, um, I feel like it's kind of getting to a limit where you might end it if this is your second marriage, okay? Let's keep going. There's a Scorpio or a Leo in, in your life. Okay. So, I see here that there are some of you who wants to put their money in their savings, in their checking, it's like you're splitting into two. So budgeting. You're really trying to make a list of, well, so this is for this month, July. The best way to start monitoring your finances, make an Excel spreadsheet, G Drive also, Google Sheets. If you're not familiar with Excel, I don't care what you do, but get those things done. Yes? Okay? Because I see here that you're trying your best to keep these resources within you. It's not how much you make, it's how much you keep. Okay. Um, two of Swords, also here, you're trying to understand um, whether you have, if you will help your family. Some of your family needs some support and you're thinking, it's like, well, okay, so this is what's going to go to the family and this is what's going to go to mom and dad and so on and so forth. So I'm seeing it here. Like you're divided. You're a person who has uh, um, other people involved in your money, okay? So it's not just you. All right, you got the Justice card. Okay, the justice card. 
Now, I'm seeing here that there will be legal matters concerning about a business that you're about to open, uh, an LLC, uh, you know, a corporation, a C-Corp, S-Corp. Um, those are legal terms. Um, you might need to lawyer up if this is a business idea. I see here that you're going to be consulting. Um, especially like you have the justice here, then permits is going to be uh, something that you would need. Um, this justice card also shows that um, there's a lot of planning. Um, so there will be, uh, how to say this, like you can be in a part of a construction business. This is because I see here the eight of coins. There's a lot of drawing. So meaning you could be an architect, an engineer, or you're considering flipping houses because this is a deed. I'm seeing here that there are deeds. So flipping houses, building houses, um, it can be part of your um, business venture. Uh, I'm seeing here with a justice card and two of swords. Um, this is... Uh, with regards to your romantic connection, I see here like you're trying to decide whether to make this relationship work with a Leo or the Scorpio or to finally file for divorce. So you're in a crossroads, whether to keep the marriage, okay? So for your romantic connection. I'm seeing here you're trying also to think whether it's time to have a second baby. Some of you guys want to have a second baby. Why not? For me, you know, get a 12th baby, you know? I'm kidding. <laughs> <laughs> so it's not you the 12 years of pregnancy that's it. you're almost gonna go to your what's that a k2 dash is seven years rahu is 18 venus dash 20 no 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 i see you're considering uh if you're married um remember you married people are here are welcome with this reading okay because there is a choice here too it's like maybe it's time for us to have a second baby okay love that I love babies, especially if it's not mine and I just get to, you know, <laughs> keep them for the weekend and return it to their parents. Okay, here we go. Ooh, okay. Now, be careful. You have a three of swords. Um, some of you lost your job. Mm -hmm. Some of you lost your job. I'm not wishing ill on anyone, but of course, as uh, you know, what is currently happening in the world, then of course, it's, 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 it's very evident that you might be right now on what we call... Uh, how do you call this? Um, the government benefits like that, like the stimulus and um, unemployment. You know, I'm seeing here. But you do miss working. You do miss working. Um, there are things, matters of the hell that you might be concerned. And um, you're trying to understand whether to go to consult a doctor. Of course, you, this is not, I'm not a doctor, but you always have to consult a physician, right? Um, that's, your, you know, it's like always consult your medical advisor because there are times where you feel something is wrong with your tummy. Okay, because this is your um, sixth card over here. Now, um, I see here that, you know, don't don't sweat it. You know, try to get as much, uh, you know, like second opinion also. There are people who has betrayed you also, Libra. Some friends, okay, has betrayed you here. I'm seeing that, I don't know, let me see. Okay, I'm seeing that there are financial losses in the past, but you're trying to make that as a win. So you may have an investment and then it didn't went through. And now you're trying to convert that into more coins. So you're rising up to the ashes with that. Okay. Let's see. Now, romantic connection though. Um, there was someone who you could have been in a, an, in a work environment, like a work kind of office relationship. Um, if not, you guys were a business partner. Um, I feel like that went south. Mm -hmm. South Park, yeah. Mm -hmm. It's like it, you guys are broken apart. Relationship-wise, I feel like it's very good for you to consult business partners uh, for relationship. Um, meaning, um, if you're establishing a business, this is a perfect opportunity for you to um, learn from other people. I always say learn from the pros because they have committed so much mistakes and the mistakes are more valuable than the success story. I love to hear um, failures because those failures will be something that I will avoid. The success, I cannot be like that because that's their different chart. But the mistake, we can, sometimes we all make the same mistake, but we will never have the same success. Now you understand me how I teach? So get to the business and success, yes. Same mistakes everybody will make, but not the same success, okay. Uh, Three of Pentacles shows here that you wanna reconcile with someone that you have fallen apart with. Now, may it be a Scorpio, another Libra, or Leo, you're thinking about this every day. Um, you can be at work and you're thinking, it's like, maybe I can still fix the marriage. Okay, because I see here, <clears throat> excuse me, kids could be part of this. Uh -huh. And of course, I'm a big, uh, big supporter of marriage, as like I always say. And as much as if you guys can fix this, then go ahead. Um, but however, with the Queen of Wands here, there might be, okay, of course, what we call a third party. Mm -hmm. 
So you're having a party in the USA mm -hmm. kind of a relationship. And that's why you want to separate with this person. Justice card. Okay. With a three of swords. So you were part of a menage a trois. Mm -hmm. And that ter tore, tore the relationship apart. Okay. Let's see. Let's see. All right. So now there are, I feel like if you're trying to wait for an inheritance, that might come of a delay. Like what I mean, I, mean, I mentioned that you're going to get it, but there may, there will be delay. Um, if you are married, um, the provider in the house, meaning the breadwinner, because right now it's not the man who's the breadwinner. Sometimes majority of them is the female. Um, it's a little bit tight on the budget. Okay. So you're trying, I already seen that you're trying to make ends meet here with the eight of coins. But it feels like right now it's like Sal, it's really, really tight. I'm I'm not sure um, you know, what to do. The best thing to do right now is to invest in yourself because only you can guarantee your own success. Okay? So if work wise is not stable, in start investing in yourself. What are you good at? Okay, but not everybody's meant to be an entrepreneur. Some people are meant to be to have a business partner, because I see here business partner, but not a standalone. Okay. Let's see. If you're married, your husband is making it difficult also for you guys to settle. I feel like there is a move relocating and your husband is just like making being a being being difficult. Okay. So um well, if you want to go back to school and learn something new, I feel like that's going to be good. Well, there's online classes. There's so many things um, that you can go online and learn. I would suggest don't even pay. When I say don't even pay, go to YouTube. That's where the best thing, you can be a photographer in 24 hours. You can be, you know, it's like, but of course it comes with skill. Learning is different. Application is totally another thing. Because, so, you know, skill is a constant practice. Okay? So I, YouTube can guide you, but you know you have all these books also that you can get but application constant practice is what i can see um that you can be uh, like if you do it then it's guaranteed success nine of pentacles with the eight of pentacles you will be successful but it's constant practice eight of pentacles so um how about um how to say this like when you're becoming an artist a musician a writer it's the it's putting in the time remember that's a six house energy the more consistent you are with your nine to five the more you are guaranteed to get to get business success people who cannot handle their six house will never get to their tenth which is career in society and fame um it's gonna be like Slim pickings over there. It will not manifest. Six, due diligence. Do it now. Later, you're going to get paid. And you're going to be happy. Nine of Pentacles. That you invested in yourself. Okay? So let me continue this reading, guys. With your career, finances, and love. Um, in the extent. And the extent is different for the, from this. This doesn't get the past, present, and future. Nor um, the... Know how to call this uh, the 30 days okay? it's different meaning it I mean like if you if you guys are familiar this one wraps up differently because it's uh, it's more of a holistic way of reading which means but I will still do the bottom of the deck what I will do is three cards three bottom of the deck so you can focus on one two three those are gonna be step one step two step three um, which is gonna be an extended after I finish this reading so those are specific uh how to call this um cards that you need to remember so that this you know this is the monthly for july you will be able okay to find yourself in a better footing by the end of the month because if tarot does not help you to get back in your feet then what am i doing here mm -hmm. exactly so well what i'm doing here is promoting my glamour box okay <laughs> so check it out it's in the link in the description box down there Everything is there. Right now we have four collection. And did I mention that we have now at least 10 wands, okay? Gemstones wands over there for different purposes, okay? One, to get rid of your ex. Two, to make sure the ex is gone. And three, to permanent... <laughs> kidding. I'll see you guys again. Have a wonderful, wonderful day. This is your monthly for July. Bye, guys. One of the best features of having a line 27 in your phone is the transit. You can see on your lower right corner, you can click it and it will tell you everything about how the current transit 
movements of the planets based on your own chart. The way that it works is, once you have put your time and place of birth, it will give you this horoscope. As you can see here, it is projecting on June 21st, the solar eclipse. If you click that, it will give you all the information about how the eclipse is going to be affecting you. You can see here in this yellow highlight how it will manifest in your life. And to add bonus to this, you can also see it for other zodiacs. If you have an Aries, if you have a Taurus, it can show you every little thing about that zodiac. A Gemini, a Cancer, all to the 12 zodiacs. You can also share this as there is a share button. You can share it to your friends, family, or your loved ones. And that is your transit.